Hey guys, it's Deltara, and I finally finished the Modern Warfare version of the Insight Stats Overlay. So this is a brief tutorial video. To add Insight to your stream, you need to put in a browser source in OBS or Streamlabs OBS. And if we go to Properties, you need to put the localhost followed by the port 5000 or a port that you set here in Advanced Options. You may need to refresh the cache of the current page, uh, but not more than once to have it appear. Alright, so next we put in our Battle.net ID, which I've already done and it's been verified. This allows us to get tracker stats and COD API stats. The next two options, uh, Standard Multiplayer is the only option for now, but Warzone is coming in the next update. Uh, kill streaks, you can have them included or excluded in the kill tracking, but I would recommend excluded for now. So here we have the full bar, which includes all these nine stats. And if we run the simulation, which simulates an input kill stream, you can see what it might look like in action. You can turn off the animations, and that's all you can do for the bar. But let's say we wanted the four slot option. And we're still running our simulation, and I don't want the animations, and I want no icons, no labels, so it's just the numbers. Or I just want icons and the values, or I want uh, labels and values. Uh, with animations, you get the idea. So that's all fully customizable. Eventually, you will be able to upload a custom CSS file uh, so people can make their own themes and that sort of thing and you can choose what stat you want for each slot. So, uh, I mean, if you want to duplicate kills per minute, sure. Let's say you wanted uh, just two and you wanted you know, kill streak and kills per minute, there we go. Um, or KD and kills per minute. So we're gonna stop the simulation though and I'm gonna go back to uh, quad box. Actually, let's go to the 9 bar. I've decided to make it so that the streamer is mostly responsible for the background now, because some people like a more minimalist setup. Uh, so I usually do this background with the labels, but that's entirely up to the streamer now. It's no longer done by Insight. So if we play around for a little bit, and just get a few kills in the box. That's right! I'm drop shot in the box. Let's see if we can get him. Right, the bots are unstoppable. Anyway, those are some numbers on the board. Now, if we want to reset, you can do a key bind. So here I have control plus both brackets and if I press that you'll notice the overlay resets. Uh, these settings below w I wouldn't worry about them unless I told you to change them. And that's how you use Insight. Hope you guys enjoy it. Have a good day.